Um, we should also say that this a new filing out showing that Elon Musk sold close to 8 million shares of Tesla stock just over the past week on Twitter. When asked if he was done selling, Musk replied yes in the hopefully unlikely event that Twitter forces this deal to close and some equity partners don't come through. It's important to avoid an emergency sale of Tesla stock. Joining us right now to talk about that and more, Loop Managing Partner Gene Munster. I want to talk to you about that, but just real quick on this number that we just heard, uh, I'm curious what you think and also the multiples we're starting to see everything in tech land move this morning. Does it make sense? Yeah, it does make sense. Andrews, I think back as a tech investor, the last six months have had many sleepless nights. And the reason is that about twice a month, there's been these high anxiety points around the CPI number and around the Fed. And I think uh, obviously this was a step in the right direction relative to inflation. But the other piece that's on my mind is uh, that over the next month, we basically have a coast is clear for these high multiple stocks, right. assuming nothing happens with China. And I think that is uh, a marked difference. We've been heavily okay. in cash here, and we will probably be putting money to work in the weeks ahead. Uh, Gene, let's talk real quick on, uh, on Musk. Looks like this is a better chance that either Twitter gets a deal renegotiate the deal that that maybe Elon Musk has got religion that he's going to have to actually do this deal. What do you think this says? So I think that the odds that this happens is now above 50 percent uh, before I would have put it at about 10 percent. I'll just stick to what we really know. A lot of this is guessing. What we really know is, number one, is that Elon doesn't want to buy Twitter. Uh, he's said that he's referred to being forced yep. uh, to buy it. And the second is uh, ultimately, is uh, he is preparing for that outcome. So I think that that is telling. I think this is a negative in the near term for Tesla. I'm surprised to see the stock doing what it's doing today. And uh, ultimately, it's not about uh, the Twitter uh, deal. Ultimately, I think this is more about Tesla delivery numbers. But to, to put it in a, in a nutshell, is that the probability that this happens goes up and uh, Elon doesn't want this deal to happen. And you're looking at uh, Twitter stock up about three and a half, a little over three and a half percent this morning. Gene, it's great to see you this morning. We appreciate you, you joining us.